Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a boot Windows 7 with pre-installed Windows 8.1. You will need to disable UEFI in Windows 8.1. I have a link in the description box that will help you do that. Now right click this PC, Manage. We need to create a partition for Windows 7 installation. Now go to Disk Management, locate your C drive, and right click on the blue bar select shrink volume now here enter the amount of, uh, of space you wish to shrink it's in megs so I'm gonna select 20 gigs which is 20 about 20,000 megs and click on shrink it has created this unallocated partition this is where I'm going to install Windows 7 now make sure you can identify it while installing Windows 7 now place the Windows 7 disk in the drive and restart the computer. You should see uh, this, press any key to boot from CD, DVD, press enter. If you don't see this, I have a link in the description box uh, so you can change the first boot device in the BIOS so you can, so you're able to see that. Now go ahead and select your language, time and keyboard, click next, install now, accept the license terms, select custom advance here. Now make sure to select the unallocated space that we created. If you select a different partition, it'll delete your Windows 8.1 and install Windows 7 deleting all of your personal files including the operating system it'll be replaced with Windows 7 now the system will restart several times make sure not to press any key when you see this and here select Windows 7 to finish the installation of Windows 7 Once you're done now uh, installing Windows 7, you can restart and choose whether you want to uh, boot from Windows 8.1 or Windows 7, as you can see. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.